One of the first things you'll notice in TVC version 5 is that the user interface or UI uh, looks a little bit differently when, when you first launch it. Um, to start, you'll get onto the start page. We've organized the projects in a more graphical fashion where you'll be able to more easily and more readily be able to recall past projects open listed here in the projects interface the yellow buttons for new project and open project as well are prominently featured and the notifications along the right hand side when you're connected to an internet connection you will see the latest TBC news from power hour announcements to documentation notifications to new version notifications let's dive into that new UI a little bit further in projects, you'll see here I've got a selection of nine projects that I've got with a little thumbnail. There's a couple of different views for this now. I see it in tile view. I can change it to list view. There's a couple other options here. With the three dot uh, drop downs, you can pin to the list, you can remove from the list, you can upload a custom thumbnail, you can remove a thumbnail or you can show the project folder and this is really nice because this will jump you into the uh, Windows folder that the project is located in. Uh, in addition, uh, quick access toolbar up top, we put a lot of the similar or uh, duplicative commands that showed up a bunch of times in these various tabs uh, across the top here into the quick access toolbar. So things like Project settings and options are there. Your coordinate system manager, your feature definition manager, uh, those have been there in past versions. But now, things like reports here, or print, or some measurement commands uh, as well, as well as the uh, view filter manager uh, toggle. So a lot of new things want to uh, keep it handy. You'll notice that the status bar here has got an added information. Uh, we've moved the rectangular and the polygon select down here, uh, as well as a nice add for what coordinate system your project is currently in. I am in an open uh, project. I'm in US survey foot units and grid and UTM 13 North. One thing that I did skip over is this login button. If you click this, this allows you to sign in to Trimble Connect. So I'm going to log in to my Trimble Connect account. I can toggle to stay signed in. And it picks up my free Trimble Connect uh, account with my Trimble ID. That is accessible in the upper right corner here um, in this the Trimble Connect icon. Um, what this does is this logs you into Trimble Connect and will allow for quicker access to Trimble Connect services when you're in TBC. So for example, I've got a power line data set here. I'm in a known coordinate system. I can use this command to toggle background map. And before you'd have to log in, but now since I'm already logged in, the background map loads. I can view that. Uh, readily. So things like saving or opening remote files from the Trimble Connect environment, uh, sync man Trimble Sync Manager, or publishing to Clarity now made a little step easier. We have changed the theme. You can see here there's more of a light theme with uh, sort of flattened, modernized icon approaches here along the top. Uh, moved a couple of things around, made for simplification and clarity of icons and new features. We did package what we've called the traditional theme. So I have opened the options and in options right up top in general display theme options of light or traditional. Some other things to note, we've moved the use large icons for quick access toolbar here as well. That will kind of uh, um, magnify the smaller icons of quick access in Project Explorer and down here in the status bar. You can toggle that in the use large icons for quick access toolbar. That will require a restart of TVC. Just some other quick highlights and tabs. In the support tab, we have added a lot of the resources 
uh, available to you. Uh, with TBC version 5, we've merged geospatial and the construction flavors of Trimble Business Center together. So you'll see links to the geospatial TBC website, the construction TBC website, as well as things like the tutorials base, our TBC survey and construction YouTube channel, our Facebook page, links to the power hours, geospatial community, construction community, and the Trimble Retrieve platform. Um, one last thing here in the new UI is that we've uh, attempted to make customizing the ribbon interface much easier with the set ribbon tabs command. If you click on that, you will get the current default ribbon here with check marks for all of the tabs that are shown. By default, you will see what you have licensed. If you had wanted to, for example, hide some of the uh, uh, specialty module solutions such as mobile mapping or tunneling, for example, uh, you just uncheck those. You'll see those will come down to the hidden. Click OK and your ribbon menus are updated without those. To bring those back, you just go into set ribbon tabs again check those back on and you can see those are updated in real time. We're excited to introduce this new uh, UI and uh, ribbon interface as well as further the integration with the Trimble Connect platform and the Trimble Connect services in TBC version 5.